Good morning. It is uh, February 9th, I think. Uh, it's about 8, 8.30. Um, Carrie's still sleeping. So I'm just sitting in my bed, uh, stitching. Um, we're going to go to uh, her mom's house for pancakes, because I guess it is pancake day here in the UK. So we'll see what today brings. This is the view just outside my window. Um, blue skies today, well for now anyway, partly cloudy. Um, at least it's not pouring rain right now, which is good. This is the back view of her house. So that's our weather forecast for today. Hopefully it'll stay that way. Oh look, there's a cat. Talk to you later. So I'm going for a walk. It's about 9 o'clock in the morning. And Carrie's still sleeping, so I thought I would just go for a walk. This looks like a... I don't know what this is. What is this? There's a school there. I don't know. Looks pretty neat, though. mixed in with houses or like these are houses I think or what do they call them? Terraces? I think. I don't know. Anyway. And then they go down and then there's some shops. So, so here's some neat houses I think. They look neat to me. Canadian on the streets of Norwich. Here's a place called the Beehive. It looks... I think Carrie mentioned this. Uh, I think it's a restaurant. Yeah, it's a restaurant. some homes that look like homes with a yard and front yard and a driveway. So this is what I've seen so far. They got a nice front yard and trees and a horse crossing. What does this mean? Some more beautiful homes. I'll just take a walk along here and show you guys. They got hedges and then they got their yards and their driveways and stuff.
so it looks quite private because it's on a busy road. So I think that's two houses, but I'm not really sure. And the gas station. <laughs> Here's just the outside of the Bolton Golf Course. Great golf lessons for beginners. Woo -hoo. Okay, so I think it's snowing. like sleet. So there goes our weather. But here is uh, some homes here on the golf course. probably turn around now. Um, some homes off of the golf course. <clears throat> I'm not sure if this is all one home or not. I don't know. I think it's a like a duplex. <laughs> so I don't think she's filming me, she's vlogging me vlogging, <laughs> which is quite cool. Yeah, so um, I'm just going to get everything together and we're going to set off and go for a walk. So I'll probably film a bit of her out and about. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> Here we are, going for a walk Got now. <laughs> this road isn't very good for buggies so though. It's alright. I found my walking partner now. Maybe if I get too tired, she'll give me a lift. She can give me a double. So here we are at Fleet, Fleet Street. And I got, I guess, some old, old style, old style, old, old style cottages. Got the brick, the brick walls here. Quite big homes, even if they are like. That's, that's more like a 1930s um, build, that one. So the ones that are up further are older? Oh, yeah, about 1700. 1700. Okay, well, we'll take a look at those. But I'm liking the brick wall. Okay. And then there's some. Some trees and stuff, some nice trees. Lots of trees. Lamp post. Lamp post yeah. Yeah. Are we in Narnia? <laughs> Looks a bit like it. Yeah. <laughs> so Carrie's taking me for a lovely walk through the cemetery. <laughs> um, we have to go through here to get to where we're going. Yeah, no, that's fine. I'm going to show you some old tombstones, I believe. That's the old chapel. It's no longer in use. It's just oh. behind Here's an old chapel. It's obviously not in use anymore, but here's a big green tree. Ooh. All right, so here we are still in the cemetery. There's some big, beautiful trees. It's very beautiful here. Buried anywhere for a church because it's a place to come. Yeah, it's, it's a beautiful resting place. Now we're going to try and find some old stones. This one. So. That one looks quite old. Though. Yeah, this one here looks quite old. Let's see. 1930. So that's not old, old, but. Afterwards, 
that great to be added to the second one because it's kind of really old ones. Here we are in Ridgemont, and it's hailing. Here we are going for our walk, and good old England is giving me a good old Canadian welcome. Yeah. So, I'm going to go walk up to these older cottages, she calls them. Carrie can't make it, so she's just going to be right there. Wave! Carrie! I'll be right back. So this is Curly's. This is a, I guess, a nice restaurant, fish and chips restaurant. Looks out onto the water. And there's some old cottages up there. So here we are at some old cottages, I believe. Well, she said there would be a, a marker with a date on it, but I haven't seen any. Yet. No frackling here. No frackling here, it says. They have a lovely view. Well, I'll just walk to the end of this thing. road. Um, this is where you go fishing. It's called the fishery. You can see, if I can zoom in here, you can see people actually fishing over there. And see the little docks? That's where you put your rod in and go fishing. I'm not sure what kind of fish they would catch here, but um, fishing is fishing is fishing. So here we are on, what street are we on? Charlie Old Road. you got to repeat that. Charlie Old Road. <laughs> okay. And here's some old cottages, and I guess this is where people live. So here we're walking down the street. What is this? Some kind of a... These look like bigger, more expensive houses in Horwich, but I don't know. There's Carrie up there. According to Carrie, this is a very weird house. Not traditional English house. nursery. Um, it was built in what year? 1793. 1793. And then we're going over here to the cathedral. So that will be our next stop. So here is the cemetery of the old church. Um, I'm not going to go in there because it's too muddy and Carrie can't get in there. But uh, there's the old church. Here we are at a proper crossing. Press the button. And we gotta wait for the green man and now it's safe to walk. And now they're both gonna stop. I hope. And here we are and it is hailing again. Having my first 
British lunch out. Broccoli soup and a chicken panini. And filtered coffee. And sugar cubes. Hi, this is Kerry vlogging for Dee. <laughs> and we were just Hi. showing <laughs> we were just showing the height difference between Dee and my mum. Because Dee's five foot ten and how tall are you, Mum? Four foot eleven. Oh, four foot eleven is yeah. like your four ten. So no, 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 no,